Okay, we've got a question here, it's about a Poisson distribution, and that's for numbers of A grades in maths, and it applies each year. In part A, we've got a five year period, so the mean that applied to each year needs to be adjusted, so you need to set up a suitable Poisson distribution with an adjusted mean, and then use the fact that we need more than 18 A grades. Now the standard advice there is to actually draw 17, 18, 19, dot 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 each side. Draw a loop around the values you want and decide exactly how you're going to use the tables to get that value accurately. Then in part B we've got, as well as math grades, we've now got English grades and the number of A's in English is Y and we want the probability that there was a total of fewer than 15 so fewer than 15 in maths and English combined so we've got a Poisson distribution for the maths we've got a Poisson distribution for the English the total number of grades you're going to set up a new distribution for that and then again by drawing the outcomes accurately use tables to find the probability of fewer than 15 and then in Dotty 2 we've got to make an assumption when we're adding two Poisson distributions and using a Poisson distribution for the total, that only applies under certain certain circumstances. In fact, the key word is independence, but you will not get the mark just for that word independence. You have to state what is or are independent in order to get that mark. 